Hi, my name is Sean Liu, Senior Field Application Engineer. I'm going to talk about how to set up E800 parameter setting in FR Configurator 2. Go to Tools, Ethernet Parameter Setting. Click OK when prompted and do inverter detection. FR Configurator 2 will find inverter. Change your desired IP address, network number, and station number. And write. After writing, do inverter reset by clicking yes. Close window. Start a new project. Change PC site port to Ethernet and click auto recognize, then yes. Confirm Ethernet is selected and click OK. After you see the inverter, click OK. Double left click parameter, go online and do a batch read. Do a quick verify to see what's changed. Change parameter 1429 with 44818 to enable Ethernet IP and write. Change parameter 1449 to 1452 to command source IP address. Do a batch write and power cycle. I'm going to talk about how to set up E800 ADS file in Alan Bradley PLC. Go to Tools, EDS Hardware Installation Tool. When prompted, click Next, then Next, click Browse, and select and open E800 EDS file, then Next. Keep clicking Next, then click Finish. Right-click Ethernet and select New Module. Under Search Box, type E800. Double-left-click FR E800, E when appears. Under Name, type in E800 underscore E. Click Private Network and type in 5. Click Change and select Extended Speed Control under Name drop-down list. Change Size to INT and click OK. Then Yes. Click OK. Two E hundred underscore E input output tags are created. I'm going to talk about how to set up E hundred AOI in Alan Bradley PLC. Right click AOI 
and click Import AOI. Select the AOI as shown. Click OK. Expand main program and click main routine. Drag E800 AOI into the ladder diagram. Create tag for E800 AOI. For input data and output data, point it to VFD module tag created. Create remaining tags for the AOI. Check and make sure no error exists. Download the program. Change to remote run. Reset fault. Turn on user net control and user net ref. Write the value to user speed ref. Turn on user forward and watch it run to referenced speed. Turn off user forward and turn on user ref to watch it run reverse. Turn off user ref and wait for it to stop. 